So here we are, the old manor. Do we have enough space for these? We do. Get a bag of tick here. Behind your circle, can we take any of that? No. Red light. The guy came and broke the contract. <clears throat> Old Manor, Secret, Salamandra Base, and next time we'll see Full Sets will tell enough to West Betrayal. Are there any other character entries in anyone? Nurses. Some women feel compelled to care for others, bring them relief from their suffering. They become nurses, priestesses, and medics, treating the sick and wounded, providing comfort and hope to those in need. And. We'll see. That's a Raymond Marlowe detective. Roderick DeWitt. Yeah, nothing new about him, <clears throat> even though we killed him. Las Vegas, not dead. Old man. Yeah, we may actually not. not actually, they're not completing the uh, vampires. Not the dagger though, that's cool. Well depending on how lucky we get, we're finding some Okay, so there is a good chance for that's the wrong button. It's cute. I'm watching my warriors for things. Steel and silver? Let's find out. Well, yeah. They died. <laughs> Considering they're not monsters, they're technically people things, but I don't know. Wetland. That's the approach for the old manor. <clears throat> The arrow itself is not all that interesting or vital for anything. Yeah. Oh, huntsman, tall lad, some beast of some kind. Again, we are reaching the end of the game now, of all means. We're not exactly strapped for cash, we have plenty of money. So let us see. Is that a person up there or I think that's a person. That's a masked warrior. So yep, this is a salamandra base. Corpse. Uh, throne, just in case you haven't gotten any of that. Some high quality potion bases, money, and a chicken sandwich. Some enchantment. We have ten of those. Fireplace, just in case you need some of that. Plus, that's also why there was some high quality alcohol in that guy, just in case you need some. For brewing. Do we need to brew anything though? Oh, we could make some wolf potions just to stag us up completely on those, but I don't really don't know. I'll we'll make some more tawny owl. Yeah, you know what? Let us brew a whole lot of potions before we enter this place, even if I mean, they're people. So yeah, it'll last for a long time. No way. Give some death to the motherfuckers. It worked. <laughs> uh, Assassin's Dagger, it's better. Have all the salamander brooches. Sweat? 
squared. But really, 100% bonus damage and penetrate the opponent armor, they don't stand a chance. Let's sit again in the fireplace, right there. So, remember, I'm going to say an albedo as the dominant thing in the drink. We have another level up. So, if we are to make a tawny owl, let's see, one of these, and a blue with the albedo. Some green with the albedo. We need green with the albedo in it. No, we don't need any <laughs> green, that's for the swallow potion. It's purple. We need for the tawny owl. And round brains, so luckily can contain just that. And Albedo as the dominant thing. We need to make as many of those as we can, really. Or up to four more. Two. This one will be the third. And now the fourth one. And we shall not be left wanting for any of those potions ever again. Now let's make some white gold. And it wants to use a white gold instead of this, this ass off. Use high quality potion base. Could use that for just brewing a generic potion of some kind. Or we can just go with the <clears throat> smart way of manually brewing a white goal. Even though a swallow and a white rapids. Let's max those out too. Or some wolf potions. Whatever. Let's make the white goal first and then start worrying about the other things. Let's see. Cool blood. Beast fangs, they are not really all that important. Those and a green, which will be the cadaverine, because that's amongst that one. And. Right. Yeah. Yeah, yes. Do this for the sake of it. And now we will go back to the alchemy. <clears throat> <clears throat> I beg your pardon. Even though that's not really what you say in this situation, I don't care. Let's see, a swallow potion and a white rapids decoction. And we will take those and stack those two. And just for the sake of it, what was it that albedo did again? Oh, greens. Formulae? No, oh, glossary, of course. Albedo, lower level of toxicity. See, that's something one can play an online game. <laughs> nah. Oh well. Yeah. Let us see. We could also make some more wolf potions. But I don't know if we really need more of those. Um, Hanged Man's Venom could be pretty useful considering we're going to go up against a lot of people. So, Hanged Man's Venom uses Dark Tallow. Okay, yeah, let's make one. Macrophage oil. Ah, we don't really need that, do we? Plenty of other upgrades too, so. Yeah, I'd say this here is a good bit of alchemy. Oh, the game just went black screen. Oh. Well, I was just scared for a moment. This sword and the hangman's venom lasts for a long while, so let's apply that to our sword. Our hangman rune seal, call here, and uh, one for us. <laughs> that guy has no more wheel. He's in for a surprise. What's he doing? Hackman Rune Sickle. No one has Kolk here. Kolk here. Kolk here. 
The dwarf himself, the dentist, said Glarkia, I think. Yeah. Glarkia. Glarkia. Sihil or Glarkia. Either works, I think. Council of Walton Manor. Burnt Settlement. Let's go to the Burnt Settlement first. Okay. That's interesting. Greetings, Geralt. Have you met Rayla? A singular transformation gave her the gift of life. Geralt! A singular transformation. The gift of life. You call that enslaved bag of blood and muscles alive? Better than alive, perfect. You'll learn that soon enough. This was your experiment? You're pathetic. Rilla, darling, you won't permit this mongrel to insult your master. <sighs> Geralt! Okay, so. That there's what's left of the white railer. The girl that catch the wall off. Is it blinding? I think we're blinded. Yep. Still blinded. Let's go for a little world then. Orange, grindstone, and some white raffets. <laughs> well, then we have some fine emergency. But I came upon Rayla. She underwent a mutation that has clearly affected her mind. Unfortunately, I have to kill her. She has left me no choice. The question is, is, how the hell did Salamandra get their hands on her corpse? She, she was left alone. It was inside the city and she was technically working with the Order. Hmm. Let's see. We met the mercenary again. Salamandra found her closer to, close to death and subjected her to mutation. Rayla recuperated and, as a mutant, regained her strength in no time. In return for a second life, she had to swear absolute loyalty to her new master. She tried to stop me and I had to kill her. For good this time. Yeah. Now that's not um, what we want for, to happen to anyone. Salamandra are bad people. They are well mean some motherfuckers. So. Arm and hand, holding a group star. Big ready. Someone to sell things to. Mutagen. Ah. And a beast liver, which we can't carry more of. Let's see, this seems to be an approach that leads up. So I'm thinking before we do that, let's see if we can go back that other way. We'll still have this on for a long time. Just in case something's hiding behind here, or... Or yeah. Well, yeah, anything else like that, you know. Doesn't seem like it. A decent view of the forest. With modern graphics, that, that would look beautiful. And for its time, it does look beautiful. And I remember playing Elder Scrolls for Oblivion back when it was the latest Old Scrolls game. And certainly just with the music and the environment, I was just awestruck that, damn, this is beautiful. I just had to stand there for a moment in game, just look at this the landscape while Jeremy Soule's beautifully composed music just massaged my ears. You 
Alright, you challenge Carol the Witcher. White Wolf. And owner of several other less pleasant nicknames. Goose fat. We don't need that. Sweat though, that will gladly take. Blizzard potion. Yeah, they have Witcher potions. And they still stole off from the secrets. Likely would prevent them from getting all of the secrets. We're going down into the laboratory there in the beginning. <laughs> I just fell over. Well, I'm back now. That's a lot of things. Mutant assassin. Question if why do Salamander need these mutants? Is it just because they're bad? What do they have some kind of grand plan? Oh. Sumerian knights. And I think that's true too. That's pretty cool. I can get help. Sure, but they looked like mutants. You came just in time. I could hardly desert you. Thanks, Triss. Geralt. Salamandra must be based in some of the old manor. What's the situation at the front? I was just asking that. What's the situation at the front? Scoyatel are murdering humans, the Order is slaying non humans, and Foltest soldiers are trying to restore order. So far, it's a tie. It's not looking good. Not tragic either. Now that you've cured Ada, like any reasonable monarch, Foltest has approached the Lodge about an alliance. The Lodge will provide the support he needs to retain his throne and restore order. Ah, the secret plan succeeds. Thanks to you, among others. But most importantly, hundreds of lives will be saved. Triss. I know, Geralt. I know. So, what we've been doing is apparently also help the Lodge of Sorceresses get some foothold with Foltest. That's not necessarily a good thing. Because they are not good people. And Tris still being, well, as we found out in the third chapter, yeah, she's still in leagues with them. But now we've got in game confirmation, as in Geralt has the information. So he has it confirmed. That's a chest and trunk. Let's look inside of it. Some more runes, high quality potion bases, a whole bunch of other good stuff. Dried fruit needed. The thing, all the other chapters. We've done the Semitor, we've done the Blitzwiger, we've done the Brooks of Arcane, we've done the Wraith. Let's just drop them all on the floor, considering we don't need them. And the game itself did not let us just auto delete them, whatever. Now let's go check these remains, just for prosperity's sake. Um, these mutants are seemingly capable of drinking witcher potions. A normal person will die if they drink witcher potions, meaning these mutants Salamandra are making, they're efficient and they work. Geralt. And that's scary enough in its own. Salamandra must be based inside the old manor. I think so too. So before I left the castle, I snatched a key to the crypt. From there, we can enter the catacombs beneath the manor. Triss, you're a genius. Shall we? 
Let's go. So, if memory serves, if we had given Alvin to Shani, Shani would have shown up here instead. And I want to help. Oh boy. That's a big guy right there in the background. Great brother. There's no sense staying here. We don't know what Salamander is planning. You need to enter their base. Then let's go. No, I'll stay here. I've still got strength left, so those mutants are going to taste some fire. It's too dangerous, Triss. Since when do I need your permission to cause trouble? Or you mine, for that matter? Triss. Another time. They're coming. Go. I detest tearful goodbyes. See you, Triss. Catacombs. I'm getting close. Close to Javed. Um, there, there, we have a brook there. And some guy came. Let's hope we'll get to return to Colstein. This one is nice to wasn't it? is the okay. Yeah, Champion was one around the Brooks of things. Oh, I came to live it. We all let go of that. I'll take that instead. Guard came. Caught Steam Brooks. Champion. Some more vampires. There we go, that should give us the two saliva we needed. Huh. Open this door and let them out. You will die slow. Be sure you pass first. Wrong sword. It fell through the ground. <laughs> Let's see. Passage to laboratory. The two doors. They both probably lead the same place. Considering we're in for a bit of a long track here, I think we'll down a swallow version. And just so that we're actually able to see anything, our cat potion. Even if, in the books, witches' eyes adapt to night and dark on their own, and that's why they. Oh boy.